This is Bill at Highland Home Farm, and today I wanted to give you a little uh, bunch of advice on growing evergreens in your habitat. One of the most important things about growing quality evergreens, whether it's for your deer or for landscape purposes, is to make sure that it grows healthy and that it has a chance of being a strong, durable tree. You don't want to spend a lot of time planting something in your habitat and then come to find out it's not, not correct. So just a little bit of trimming care can go a long way in making a quality plant. And I'm going to give you an example here of a plant that needs to be trimmed. Now this, this plant here needs to be trimmed. It's a nicely shaped plant, but it has one major defect which is fairly common, and that is it has multiple leaders. And so all you want to do here is just snip this off and keep that extra leader from growing. And the reason for that is that you want the tree to grow true and straight and not have two leaders because when it gets under snow load, it'll fall apart and collapse and be a damaged tree. The next thing you want to look for is if you have like what we have right here. You see right in here we have a vine growing up. You want to keep these vines from growing up in your trees because that keeps the tree from growing straight. And what you want to do is just get down here at the base if you can, find out where it's growing from, and just pull it out and get it weeded so it doesn't grow. It's very simple. And again, you want to walk down through your trees looking for ones that have multiple leaders starting and just snip them off just like that and just like that. And you'll have a much stronger tree. Now you may notice that on my mowing, I use tree guards. This is called an orchard guard. And that helps prevent the, tr the tires from slicing the trees when you're mowing. It's a good idea to mow around your trees because it keeps the weeds down and allows the tree to develop a better base. And you want to have a lot of quality trees when you're growing trees because after you grow a quality tree you can sell it and it's a great way to make extra money on your property if you can sell the extra trees that you have and thin your your plantation out and then you'll have a quality place to hunt now one of the problems with this field for a hunter and privacy on your field is that from a major road like this People will look right down and see all your deer and then they'll want to come poach. So I would plant the trees, a row of trees along the road to block out the traffic so people can't see into where you're growing trees. Now if you have any questions on growing trees, you can call us and we'll give you tips and advice. Or you can come out to our farm. We're Highland Hill Farm on Route 313 in Fountainville, PA. And we also have a hunter access program here to allow deer hunters to come with their bow and arrow and hunt deer. So if you're interested in that, you can call us and come out to see us. We're in Bucks County, Pennsylvania, near Philadelphia. Our phone number is 215-651-8329. This is Bill at Highland Hill Farm. Thank you for watching.